All right, it's Trib with Hall's Guide Diecast News, and we've got the next case unboxing from Hot Wheels. This is the 2024 Hot Wheels H case. As we open up this new case, I'm going to uh, just go ahead and tell you I'm experimenting with my lighting to try to get better uh, better quality on these unboxings. So let me know if this is better or worse than some of the previous unboxings. Uh, but first off, here we go. We've got the Hot Wheels 450F. And here is the wheelie chair from the Hot Wheels Extreme Sport Series. There's a donut drifter, new color on the donut drifter there. From the Fast Foodie series. Here's the Hot Wheels Braille Racer Twin Mill from the Celebration series. This time it's in green. It's kind of a satin green. And there's the Porsche 911. Carrera RS 2.7, this time in red. And the always popular Honda Civic SI, this time it's white. Carbon fiber hood from the J Import series. And then we've got the 64 Chevy Chevelle SS in red from the Muscle Mania series. Next up, it is the West Coast Flyer. That one's a white plastic. It almost reminds me of the, uh, the, the glow plastic they were using a couple of years ago on different ones, but I'm not sure that one is actually glow in the dark. And then we have the Ford F-150 Lightning Custom in black from the Hot Wheels Green Speed series. There's the El Segundo Coupe in blue. The 72 Stingray Convertible in red. As somebody commented uh, before, that is a uh, that is definitely a Chevy com uh, Corvette color right there. And we've got the Mazda RX-3 tuned from the J Import series. This is a new model, so it's the tuned Mazda RX-3. That one's pretty interesting right there. Here's the Hotwiler, new color on the Hotwiler. It's got the Netflix Let's Race up there at the top. And we've got the Volkswagen T2 pickup in gray and blue. There's the 76 Greenwood Corvette. Next up, it's the Speed Dozer in green with the brown wheels. The Glory Chaser in a new color. This one's got Goodyear graphics on it. It's the Glory Chaser. And the 15 Mazda MX-5 Miata in orange from the J Import series. The 19 Ford Ranger Raptor with the HKS graphics. The Nissan Skyline RS, this is the R30. It's got a little dust on it. Kick that dust off of there. 
There's the card art on that one. Always popular, the Skyline, no matter which version. There's the Group C Fantasy. Fiat 500E. The Chevy, 55 Chevy Bel Air Gasser from the Reverse Rake Series. It's got the Collector. GMC Hummer EV in purple. So if your Hummer EV doesn't stand out on its own, get one in purple. 63 Studebaker Champ. I think it's been a little while since we've seen that one in our main lines, but it's back. Another El Segundo Coupe. The Heavy Hitcher. Tow truck right there. The Hero Hata Merc. One of my favorite new models from the GKs. There's a Corvette C6 in yellow. The yellow really stands out on that one. And check out those yellow wheels from the Hot Wheels Roadster series. Another red Porsche 911. There's another heavy hitcher. The Batman Arkham Knight Batmobile. This time it's black and it's got some yellow pinstriping there. Kind of sets it apart from some of the previous versions of that one. There's another Honda Civic SI. The Rock and Railer from the Hot Wheels Race Day series in red and yellow with some gold accents. And then we've got the treasure hunt for the H case. It's the purple passion and it's not purple. It's got a little purple in there, uh, but there's that, uh, there's that treasure hunt logo, circle flame logo. You see it right there behind the front wheel. Uh, the wheels are blue. It's from the art car series. It has an eye on the top and some plaid graphics. That is your regular treasure hunt. There's the Dragon Blaster. All right, now we're gonna go to the back of this case here. See if we get lucky and get a super in here. I'm not, not gonna hold my breath for that one, but we'll see. There's the Humvee from the first response series. Another Volkswagen T2 pickup. A minecart. 15 years, it says on the side for Minecraft. Another Humvee. And here's the regular version of what could be your potential super treasure hunt. This is the Volvo. P1800 Gasser. It's a really weird color of blue there. Lickety split. Looks like what it says there on the side. So look for that one with uh, real rider wheels and uh, Spectre Flame paint, and then you'll have your super treasure hunt. Here is the Road Bandit. And it's the 07 Chevy Tahoe, second color for that one this year. This time it's white from the first response series. Hot Wheels Braille Racer Twin Mill. There's a Ford F-150 Lightning Custom. The Audi 90 Quattro. Another red 72 Stingray Corvette. 
Another Audi Quattro 90. Dragon Blaster. The 52 Chevy from the Hot Truck series. This is always a popular casting. Looks great with these graphics here. You've got uh, white with green and gold stripes on it. It says Hot Wheels Parts and Repair on the door there. It's pretty hard to read. It's kind of small. White wall tires. There's a BMW M3 wagon in blue from the Hot Wheels modified series. Rapid Pulse from the First Response series. Another HKS Ford Ranger Raptor. The Dodge Dart, 68 Dodge Dart in white with the Ram Chargers graphics on it, the red pinstriping. 57 Jeep FC in red, new color on that. There's another Fiat 500E. Another Batman Arkham Knight Batmobile. The McLaren Solus GT in a new color, this time in orange. And more than just orange, it's got some wild graphics there on the wheel covers there, the fenders. There's another Mazda RX-3. There's the Hero Hata Merc again. That's two in this case, which I'm really happy about. There's another 55 Chevy Bel Air Gasser. There's a lot of graphics on this one. And this reminds me, I had a really happy childhood. Dad used to roll us down the hill in tires. Those were good years. Good year. And it's the Porsche 904 Carrera GTS. This is another new model for this case. There's not a whole lot of new models in this one. In fact, I think uh, maybe only two new ones to the H case, but this is one of them. From the Hot Wheels Exotic Series. And we get another one. They were back to back in that case. Here is the Hot Wheels Ultimate T Rex Transporter. Second color on that. I think that was a new model when it came out in the first color. Uh, Roland Solo in purple with some blue and black. Second one of those. The 87 Dodge D100, new color on this light blue on the Dodge D100. Also in the reverse rake series, which is fine for a Hot Wheels, but for actually driving, that is a terrible trend. Here's the Jaguar MK1 from the race day series. All right, we get a second Nissan Skyline. So some nice pickups in this case. We get some duplicates of some really popular models. There's another Jaguar MK1. The King Cuda from the Art Car Series. Only one of these in the case. That one has an A on the top. This one is in white. And it's got the King of Hearts on it. It's got the Ace of Hearts on top. Well, it's got the Jack of Hearts on the back. So a little bit of everything on that one. Maybe it has the Queen of Hearts on the other side. I don't know. Uh, 52 Chevy is the last one in this case. 
All right, guys, that was the H case for 2024 from Hot Wheels. And I would have liked to have seen more new models. We didn't get that. Uh, but we did get a lot of carryovers uh, from the G case, a lot of the popular ones. And we got multiples of those the Skyline, the Civic, uh, the Hero Hot and Merc. So uh, good in that terms. I think we got uh, doubles of the new RX3, the tuned one, and the Porsche 904. So these are the new models for this case the Porsche 904 Carrera GTS in silver and then we have the Mazda RX3 RX the tuned version of the RX3 the regular treasure hunt was the purple passion and then the super treasure hunt this one is the regular version of it i did not pull the super treasure hunt to show you but the volvo p1800 gasser be on the lookout for that one as the super so let me know what you thought about this case uh leave your comments down in the bottom what was your favorite ones from this i would also like to hear uh, your opinion on the lighting uh for the the case unboxing portion of this definitely something i've been working on uh so want to know compare it to some of the old videos let me know better or worse give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video leave your comments and don't forget to subscribe to hall's guide diecast news and we'll see you next time